Welcome back once again to Wizard101 with k right here. Last time we last left off, we were doing this Malister himself. We got a little bit of a glitch, but we're back on track. Just defeated him. There were some other scenarios that happened where the second person that we defeated before we did the Mirror Smash had lived because he did a reduction by 25% of what my spell would usually do for damage, so he lived. But then I did the smear smash and killed both of them. He used a uh, a pig spell of some sort that they were ninja pigs. There were three of them. And he did quite a bit of damage, but I lived. So we're back on track. But we defeated him, and now we're back on track. And this is what he had to say the... Uh, the... Uh, the... Your trainer, your master trainer... Uh, this is what he had to say. Excellent work, young wizard. Now, let, now let me sh let me see to Malister. I'll show him threatening a new student before orientation. No less. Merrill. Mer Merle? This experience bar will help you track your progress. Okay, so uh, up there for now. Which right there too. You'll gain a level and be able to learn new skills. Now, do you have any questions about the young wizard? Yes, yes, you don't know how to speak. <laughs> Never noticed that. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. So I don't think there's. Never mind. Okay, so we're already back in his office. Okay. We're just fine. So you got the shop. We're just gonna show you like different packs you can get. Give seven items from that from the set professor's horde pack. And like this is showing the C, which means I think they're. Oh, never mind. But the slash means that it costs 399 currency of some sort, but it's only 199 for now. Um, I don't know if we have any of that. Do we? Do we have 75? Is what I'm seeing. Okay, so there's like mounts, which is pretty cool. You move 50% faster, like, throughout the game, I think, not actual combat-wise. Whew. Gold. Yeah, you get so much currency throughout the thing. And then you can get your own house. 
and your clothing. Man, there's so much of this game since I last played it. Also, there's a new project which Kaylee, my girlfriend, doesn't really watch my videos. Okay. Level three, you can start crafting. Ooh, level five, you can get a pet. That's pretty cool. Level seven, you can catch fish. At level 10, you can enter player versus player PvP tournaments. That's pretty cool. Level 12, you can start gardening. And at 15, you can purchase castles. And much, much more. Have fun, young wizard. Oh, there's another project that I am going to start working on here soon. Is, uh, I'm still let her know, but I think I'm going to get her sister, because her sister and her have been talking about doing MMO games, MMORPG games, and I am thinking about getting her and her sister a, uh, that's hilarious. Uh, I'm planning on getting them Guild Wars 2 for Christmas. So that's something that we need to keep secret, do not let her know about. So, but that's funny. Penny Dreadful, like that is like quite disturbing at the same time that they had that kind of name for this uh, kind of game. Like it's supposed to be a kid's game. They have Penny Dreadful. But that's the plan so far, and so I'm thinking of playing Guild Wars 2 for Let's Play in the meantime, maybe quietly not play it in front of her because that gives her clues, and that's not my plan, so... Okay. I didn't do that. That was weird. Saw a quest thing about right, right behind me. So we got a merchant to our right. We got a dual master to our right. Or that was, the merchant to our left. The dual master is to our right, Diego. We got a supreme warlord and some random Brandon Mistborn. That's pretty cool. Okay. Okay, so we're here. There's the Lost Souls down and around he over here. Okay. Arena's to our right, which is where Diego is. 
The Unicorn Park Hedge Maze. Okay. Um, let's see here. Character, we got level 2 now. We got damage plus, resistance, and accuracy with certain spells, probably. Eventually. Experience 18 out of 115. Training points, gold. Crowns, we have 75. Arena tickets, 0. Energy, 41 of 41. More in 0 seconds. So we have only so much we can do? They limited that? That sucks. Starter deck, which is 14 max spells, max copies 3, sideboard 5, no trade, no sell. And then we got the Wand of Ever Essence. Ever Essence? Hmm. So we got those two equipped right now. That's pretty cool. And then it shows like your robes, which later on give you certain uh, items. Like they give you plus three to health, plus five. You got pets, your spell deck. The treasure card button is in the upper left corner of the spell book. The treasure card button switches between spells that you've learned and treasure cards you own. Well, there goes a person with a unicorn. That looks like, that looks pretty cool. You can sort both by using the spell. School, spell of school school button. So yeah, you can go to fire, you can go to ice, storm, myth, and spell. You can balance, death, astral spells. So, so far, we only have the imp so far. And so we can't really use any other cards. That was just perfectly fine. Then we got quests. We can go defeat three souls. Find available quests nearby. Crafting, which again we don't get to level six, but I'm looking forward to checking out. Not close. Okay. Let's see here. Today is today's technically Tuesday, uh, but I'm recording and going to upload this on Wednesday. I hope everybody has a great Wednesday. Uh, That was weird. That was a lost soul right there and it just vanished. Um, I hope everybody has a great Wednesday myself. I uh, will be working till 6.30 in the evening, so. Um, how much health does he have? 55. Let's go ahead and use an imp. Should have one-shot him. So does it show how much, let me go to character, does it show, yeah it still shows 41 energy, I don't know where we use energy technically. Okay so there's brief moment where you don't have to go and get, uh, I guess there's going to be a moment where you start using energy but as of now we're not using energy which I Appreciate we fizzled on using a person, so that's always lovely. So I guess there's a certain percentage that it might not 90% chance that you're going to connect with it. So that 10% so so we've got done three so far. So the next pretty much the next seven should connect. So supposedly. So I guess after dueling once, or dueling, you get an unfazed moment, which I appreciate. Let's go ahead and use another imp, which we should connect with after he uses his spell, which is perfectly fine too. I don't know why his move didn't connect, but I'll take it. And down goes the lost sword. Defeat Lost Souls complete. There's three people over there, that's pretty cool. 
guy in orange, you got guy in red and blue. Oh, that guy has a scorpion, that's pretty cool. Olivia Dawn Willow, okay. I hope everybody has a great Wednesday. I will be working until 6.30 the evening, which I should be uploading after I get off work. Uh, this video right here, and then I got Thursday off and Friday off, so looking pretty good that day. Hopefully, uh, that day that I'm uploading this, my back is doing a little bit better, but it probably won't be, so that's always lovely. Hi. Okay, guys, let's see here. Cool. I grew up playing this game so much. It's such a good game. Olivia Donwell has a quest for us. Let's go and talk to her. Any your shot? Okay. That's like a side quest, which is pretty cool. Don't need to go against any lost souls. Okay, that's cool. I forgot about that. That you can go and find red auras, the little things over there. Which I think I should go over there. I just got a red one, and then I think that blue one's going to give us some MP. Yes. Mana. Mana pool is what... Some of those terms are mana pool for MP, um, HP, H. This is M. Considering they don't say mana pool, they say mana. I think. I'm... <coughs> yeah. There we go. Okay. He has eighty health. Let's go ahead and use. A skeletal pirate. No skeletal pirate. Imp. <laughs> Ow. Okay, so we won't try him. Should go to him. No? It's kind of surprising. Ow. Forgot all about the little auras that float around like that red one. I forgot all about that. That that's the thing. Come on, please finish him off. That'd be cool. Oh, he has an ant too. That's cool. Awesome. Hey, defeated two out of three. I'll take it so far. He's got our health back. I want really want to defeat one more person. Two, uh, f fun. <laughs> Surprisingly, I didn't get another person. Oh, I think they can't, they can't be brought in more than <laughs> that hurt. <laughs> I think, also there's another person which we do have now. If there was another skeletal person that came over here, we would have to go and uh, have the. We might be able to ha have to fight another person, but luckily we don't. And they hit like a brick wall. Oh, hello, Dark Fairy. I really want to go against you. I think fairies have a good chance of. So she's at 115. Let's go ahead and 
Let me try to help out this gentleman. Cause she has 155 health, we just... Resist, nice. This person's a pro. Seems like it, at least. I'm gonna go ahead and... Uh, actually, I don't wanna use that, I wanna use that on him. I'm hoping this guy can... What the? Whoa! Oh, the person shows up now. Hmm, so you can chat between people. That's cool. This guy's ridiculous though, like I don't see why he's a, even over here, like he's one-shotting people left and right. Cool. So just, we now we can go ahead and uh, follow the path and we don't have to, like if you see it on the sidewalk it tends to be a lot of games. They have that multi-massive online element to it. They tend to uh, have a way you, if you stay on the sidewalk, that creatures won't attack you. Or they, their range is not in that possibility of you getting attacked, so. Dakota Stormglade did a, that squinting face. Sweet! What's this? Ten max to health. I'll take that. So I'm guessing no wrong button. Oh, C for character. Um, where's our backpack? Yeah, let's ring. So we have that on, and so um, let's go back to the character. Should show yeah, 40, 487 out of four ninety seven. So that's pretty cool. Pardon me. Give me some coffee, chocolate milk ish kind of thing. hit the level three the most you can have is 300,000 gold Whew. Wow plus two percent to our uh, don't know let's go ahead and equip it we're gonna look goofy as hell. Okay, so it's resistance to uh, life creatures. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna stay on the edge because we don't really need to uh, go against these guys. Oh, okay. That's cool. Yeah, as soon as I get done with this video, which probably got another five after 
Um, after we talked to Lady... Uh, Lady Oriole, I might end the video, and then we'll go and... Uh, I'm going to upload part one, and then... don't want to go into any of these people, so I'll go away. Um, probably go in... Uh, in the video, and then I'm going to upload part one, and then I might do part three. I'm not certain yet. Might wait till Wednesday and then do an episode ahead, so. People are going against her. So we get boots, some cap, I think that's experience, and then gold. What? There's our deck. So we went and got... I thought we just got her. Okay. Okay, so... Okay. Treasure cards, and then... Our starter deck for this is... Okay, I got it now. Interesting. Okay. And yeah, we'll go ahead and just continue on about this game. <laughs> it's pretty fun so far. We need to defeat three individual fairies. Dark fairies, be precise. Okay, we are going to start off with a imp. Five, he has. And then we're gonna go ahead and use a minor life. We should finish her off. She did a good chunk to us. Cool. Collect some battery dust. You go and collect some health. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. Cool. Ow. Hopefully uh, we can get just knocked out real quick. And then we can go and uh, get this quest completed, and then I'm gonna probably end the video after that. Oh yeah, break down, dancing, dancing. Look at me, I'm dancing, I'm dancing. Sing this one up. I have against her. I think if you hit more than two, like if you had two people and you hit 
Like you went up to him and tagged him. And you had to go against two, which would really suck. <laughs> Ninety-five, okay. Uh, let's go ahead and get to go again. I'm gonna probably fine with that. Got some updates going down and over there on the left. That was weird. Okay, let's go talk to her real quick, and then I'll probably end the video. The show. Then you upload part one. Very dark. I have heard that someone has hung bone cages along the street. I fear these are being used to trap my fairies and corrupt them. Please, you must free the captured fairies from those horrible bone cages before they become corrupted. Go quickly, my friend. <gasps> Your boots. That really sucks that we're getting rid of all, all our boots because. They're gonna get rid of a robe, and it's gonna be green. So like we're gonna be all like all green because again we picked the green, we picked life as our deck. So which I'm probably fine with. I knew eventually we'd have to. Um, with that being said, guys, I'm gonna go ahead in this video right here. In the next video, we are going to free us some fairies. It is gonna continue with this really interesting and lovely game that is free on Steam. It I, I absolutely love, adored this game growing up. That being said, guys, I'm in this video right here, and we'll see you guys later.